two chairs. That is because we have a special guest. Come on in here. Okay. Hi, my name is Maya and I am Natty's friend. Yeah, and today, today we're going to be reviewing this set. It's called, what's that called? Ninjago Temporal of Resurrection. Yeah, so let's get reviewing this thing. This is ages 8 to 14 and has 765 pieces. And it also has 8 characters including the little baby dude. Now let's get into the cool stuff. Maya, what was one cool thing that you liked about this? One cool thing that I personally liked is that the roof goes down. See this bad guy? You can see him. But you don't want to see him. Ha ha. He's gone. Beautiful. Vanished. And then one cool gone. thing. Oh gosh. <laughs> one cool thing that I like is yeah. this. It has a web thing on this side and then a dead guy on that side. Let's go. Close it. And, and then there was a, no way, not that. There's a bat on this side. There's a bat right there. It was really frustrating because it kept falling off. Now let's get into the price. This set costs $69.99. And my, what do you think, The like, how would you rate it? Like, is it too high? Is it too low? I think, I mean, you know, all Legos are always too high. Yeah. I mean, this probably, it, it probably would be too high. Like, market 20 or $10 less. Mm -hmm. That's how I would mark my price. Yeah. More people would buy it. Yeah. Same with my, I think that it's a little too high. Like if it was around 60 or 50, it would be a lot better price. And on Amazon, if you want to save some money, it's $55.99. Yeah, save $15. That's a lot of money. Oh, yeah. Right? Yeah. <laughs> now let's get into the fun factor. So, my, what would you rate one through ten the fun factor for this? Probably, probably like a nine because there should be like w at least one more fun factor. Like these doors right here, they should be able to like turn around. Yeah, that would be cool. Yeah, like it's a secret where the masks are. Yeah, see those masks? I think we put them on the wrong way. Yeah, because on, on the box they're supposed to be facing in, but. You know, it's just good enough. It's okay. And I like, I really like, um, my fun factor is also a nine. I like all the people, like all their swords. That was so weird. <laughs> and one more cool factor we forgot to share last time is that there's this, these little knobby things. Yeah, and there's this baby right here. See, that's the baby. Um, oh, where did he go? Yeah, exactly. Where the baby? Oh my goes. gosh! You see it? Oh, there it is. You see it? And <laughs> now I you don't. know. See it? So cool, right? <laughs> I feel. I think the baby's gonna puke me there. Yeah. <laughs> So in general, the fun factor rating is a nine. So now we're going to be getting into how hard this was and what the rating was. So on a scale of one to ten, ten being the hardest, how hard would you rate this? I'd rate it a seven because there are a few tech parts in here, like bag three was all tech. It was all yeah. tech. And we struggled a few times. We had to get my dad to come in and help us once, but actually, it didn't, we didn't need his yeah. help. <laughs> and so I would rate that seven. How about you? So I would probably rate it a seven too, because this bottom layer right here, that was bag three. Oh yeah, that and was. And it was all messed up. Or I guess that's the middle layer. So in general, the build is a seven. Jinx. Double jinx, triple jinx, you only sell the Okay, so now we're gonna be getting into the overall view, like overall, overall rating. Yeah, so what was your rating? My overall rating for this whole entire set, fun factor build price, I would rate it all an eight. First off, I rated it an eight because it cost too much in like your local stores. Target. Yeah. I would probably rate it an eight too. Yeah. Yeah, and also because um the tech parts. Yeah, the tech. Those get. And yeah. like some of the tiniest pieces are so hard to open. I know. Some, like why? Why? 
so the overall rating for this set is a numero ocho <laughs> or eight. <laughs> hey guys, thank you so much for watching this video. We really hope you enjoy it. Maya, did you enjoy it? Yes, I definitely enjoyed it. Would you want to come back and do this again with me? Like, come on, who would? And thanks again for watching this video, and we'll see you in our next one. <laughs> <laughs>